is leg day. My legs are on fire. Child. I couldn't even complete my workout. See, when you say you're gonna take a little break from the gym, and that break turns from days to weeks to months. <laughs> Child. That workout really tried to take me out. Like Guys, on my way home, this is dedication because I came from work to the gym. It is currently two minutes past 12, Saturday the 20th of January. And let me tell you what happened this morning. Guys, 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 guys. When I tell you, I woke up hella pissed. Um, Got home now. I said, I'm going to sleep for a couple of hours because I have a lash point at 10. Guys, when I tell you the way I jolted out of my bed at half nine this morning, Guys, I was so vexed. I ended up texting Lash O, which is my Lash Tech. I was like, girl, I got the times confused. I am so sorry. I can't make it for 10, sweetheart. Um, and I felt so bad because this is someone's business. You know what I'm saying? So now I'm waiting on her to get back to me, whether I can come today at 6 as a premium slot or sometime next week as a premium slot. Oh, my God. Hold on. Wait a minute. Right, I know it's a very annoying situation, but you didn't even thank God that you're awake. Like, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I said, nah, this last appointment is not gonna be my idol, okay? Mm -mm. So, definitely had to like recoup and then you know, thank God for waking me up in the morning, did my little morning prayer, and just like chill. You feel me? Like, you missed it, you missed it. Calm down, <laughs> but yeah, it's gonna be sorted out anyway. But I ended up picking up this book again. I feel like there are a lot of lessons in this book that I still need to grab. So I'm rereading it, okay? And I'm going to share with you guys what I, what stood out to me this morning. Whatever controls this is our Lord. The person who seeks power is controlled by power. The person who seeks acceptance is controlled by the people he or she wants to please. Mm. Mm -hmm. we do not control ourselves we are controlled by the lord of our lives 
So yeah, that excerpt really stood out to me this morning, especially the part that said the person who seeks acceptance is controlled by the people he or she wants to please. And honestly and truly, that really like, that really opened my eyes a little bit because the only person we should be seeking acceptance from is God. Like, let's keep it a stack. Just being, you know, in this world alone, there are a lot of things that can become our idols, even groups of people groups of people even a person can become your idol your mood your actions your morals everything is dependent on that person that you're trying to gain acceptance from and to me that is crazy i'm like god damn that is strong because think about it how many times have you and when i say you i mean myself included how many times have we actually put ourselves in situations or positions where we have contradicted our moral standing our beliefs just to fit in i'm gonna let that sink in yeah i'm gonna let that sink in because that is strong how many times have we done that you know and how many times have we actually gone against now it's a different thing to put yourself in the position and stand strong compared to putting yourself in that position and falling and actually succumbing to it like that is crazy and it just brought me back to a time when i was younger right i never tolerated no disrespect from nobody in the work environment and that is why i've had so many jobs like <laughs> those of you who know me know how many jobs i've had in my lifetime like i don't play okay i don't play it got me thinking of that time where i didn't allow I didn't even care who you were. You could be my manager, you could be HR, I don't care. I didn't allow them to control my beliefs, my moral standpoint, how I view myself in any sort of way. So if I felt disrespected in any sort of way, I was leaving. I didn't care to be accepted from any of them. And I think that's actually such a good thing to have, not just in the work environment, but in any environment that you're in. And um, now I'm not saying that um, you should just go to any environment and be acting up and be acting anyhow. No, 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 I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that the only person you should be seeking acceptance from is God. He fulfills you, period. There is no one on this planet or even all the other planets that is worth changing for, worth bending your back for, just to get acceptance from them or that person or that group of people that was just my little you know word for today but yeah i would definitely recommend you guys to go pick up this book and read it shout out to henry for getting me this book it has been such a blessing and such an eye-opener and that's why i'm rereading it because guys i will read this book as many times as it takes to learn all the lessons that i need to learn from this book i will check in with you guys once i get some motion in this ocean God, that was so corny. <laughs> right, I will talk to you guys later, okay? Nobody, 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 me, nobody. So, guys, I have an update. Did I go into town to buy stuff for my holiday? No. I'm not on my way to get my lashes done? No. Do I have something else to do? Yeah, right, so my hair is laying down. So I was invited to my previous job's Christmas party, right? And I was like, oh, today is going so hectic. Like I have so much to do and I've missed my last appointment. Like I'm vexed low key, but not vexed because Jesus is going to take the wheel. Um, but I was like, oh, I don't think I'm going to go. But now I'm just like, just pull up on them. Like, you feel me? Like, pull up on them. So I'm going to go. It is currently... 5 what 3 38 and we're meeting up at the camden for pre-drinks at seven and then we're gonna head over to the opium at half seven so i need to be ready and leaving my house by around six and um, so that's what i'm gonna do <sighs> child today is something else but no shout out to lash oh she's doing my lashes tomorrow after church so i'm super duper grateful for her to squeeze me in, you feel me? 
so yeah i'm currently getting ready to head out um just to pick up a few groceries let me stop so yeah i'm about to head out to get some groceries i'm gonna bring you guys with me i'm just gonna do something light not too much um and yes if you see color turn that could be a small one i'm like he's like a dude i did 30 head with it's all my god so what's your height are you a height new oh it's not your height you are a liar so like it is fine it's just like it's just that's the best thing do you guys want to head to the vlog <laughs> How could I forget Miss Mamas? Say hey darling. Hey darling. Hey darling. <laughs> <laughs> ahead of the game with this little mini weekend vacation prep but child i feel like i got nothing done by the way i got my hair done yesterday you guys followed me there i don't know i feel different yeah i'm about to try on a few pieces i also got a delivery from zara got it delivered to the store so that i can try it on in the store and if i don't like it it's going back, okay? Immediately. I'm just gonna bother bringing it home. I'll show you guys what I got. Tell me your desire boxes be so hard to open. Like, 
realized I had to open a cardboard box. Watch me fly, These gorgeous, gorgeous heels. Oh, these are so cute. The heel on them is not too long either. But yeah, they're just so pretty. I think they're like the go in the metal. So these are the shoes on. <gasps> they look so pretty. Oh my god, they look so nice. They're definitely very different. Like I don't have anything like this. So guys, I'm currently on my way to get my nails and toes done. Um, Leah Nails is not in town so she can't do my nails. So I'm going to get a very simple set in the store and hopefully they can do what I want because sometimes they like to flop. <laughs> 